Hi everybody, welcome back to English Grammar with Teacher Matthew. Today we will talk about possessive pronouns. But before we go on, what is a pronoun? A pronoun is a word that replaces a noun. In other words, they are words we use instead of a noun. Now, what are possessive pronouns? Possessive pronouns are pronouns that demonstrate ownership, showing that something belongs to a particular person. In this lesson, we will talk about subject pronouns, object pronouns, possessive adjectives, possessive pronouns, two examples, and summary chat. Now on to subject pronouns. What do you understand by subject pronouns? In English, subject pronouns are hi, you, he, she, it, we, and now let's talk about object pronouns. For object pronouns, we have me, you, him, her, it, us, and them. Now, possessive adjectives. In possessive adjectives, we have my, your, his, her, it's our and there. Now to possessive pronouns. For possessive pronouns we have mine, yours, his, hers, its, ours, and theirs. Now let's consider the first example, which is going to be between subject pronoun and possessive adjectives we have i have a shirt my shirt is green you see how we use the word you have a book your book is new he has a pillow his pillow is soft she has a dog her dog is small it has a bone its bone is hold. We have a bird. Our bird is noisy. You have a house. Your house is big. They have a car. Their car is slow. Now let's have the second example between possessive adjective and possessive pronoun. My shirt is green. The shirt is mine. Your book is new. The book is yours. His pillow is soft. The pillow is his. Her dog is small. The dog is hers. Its bone is hold. We don't have its as a possessive pronoun for that. Our bird is noisy. The bird, the bird is ours. Your house is big. The house is ours. Excuse me. The house is yours. Their car is slow. The car is theirs. Now let's go on to the chat. You can see the combination of subject pronoun, object pronoun, possessive adjective, possessive pronouns. So these are what we have to learn today. See you again next time. And have a 